Happy 4th of July, everyone. And we have a 4th of July event that's happening right now. Patch just came in and it looked very interesting. It looks like it'll give us some quests to do and also some prices afterwards. So we are going to do a lot of missions. There are 10 in total that they say. And the guide is already here in the War Portal website already. So you just have to complete them. But the best part of this event is that you can actually get some uh, community created headgear. It says right here. After completing all 10 requests, return to Miss Brando and Komodo. And you will receive 6 million base XP and 4 million job and a star spangled bandana dude it's nice the bandana is this one it looks really nice and a community created headgear box so basically they're giving out uh items in this fourth of july event i have the shrine maiden hat and it's really good for a priest high priest and it makes your Magnus Exorcismus uh, instant cast. I have the Divine Guard hat for my Paladin. And also I did buy the Harvester hat for my Alchemist before. Because it was really cheap. I think I bought this for 25 million. So I don't know much of the other hats. But these are the three that I know. And I believe I, really, I purchased my Shrine Maiden for 50 million. And this Divine Guard hat for 50 million. And my Harvester, I probably bought it for 30 million. So, whichever hat that you get, you can resell it to someone else. And I'm sure a lot of people will buy it. So, it's free, Zenny. And I'm not sure if it's account wide, but if it's character wide, dude, I'll use all of my characters to get all this uh, free headbands dude I will definitely do it and you can also get the a buff but only if you wear the bandana the special buff NPC veteran citizen will provide you with special buff wearing the star spangled bandana NPC will provide you the buff immediately not the item so the item doesn't have the buff but you can get the from the from the NPC so it's nice blessing Aji Carry Elise on small mana potion. Oh, that's cool. Small life potion buff. Nice, right? The minimum requirement for this event is level 70 character. So even if you're new to the game, level since 70 is easy to reach and you can get this uh, join the event. I hope it's per character, dude. Ah, dude, imagine all the awesome hats I'm gonna get from it. Next. We are now getting costume mileage coin. I guess if you buy some costume, you'll get some uh, costume mileage coin as well. And you go to Malando and to this NPC. And you can trade it in for some gemstone and costume. The gemstones are nice. So basically per costume, it's like you get one coin. So you'll have to buy 10 costume. And nice uh, stones. There's a lot of stones. There's 10 and there's also 15 if you want some blue if our effect shadow effect for 15 coins and lower enchantment stone It's nice uh, XP stone. I don't think there is any greed uh, Stone though I did I searched and it, it wasn't here But there's high level stones as well for 30 uh, coins and limited costume is you can trade them in how much for to trade them in it didn't say oh 200 costume mileage coin my god dude this is so expensive uh this one is for 150 costume mileage coin i mean they're nice no, i'm not gonna lie 50 costume mileage coin dude this is so expensive permanent costume what these are not permanent limited time okay these are just limited and these are the permanent coin uh custom aura of the sea glow 20 custom coin not bad not bad and purple pink blue for 30 custom uh huh, not bad but it's so big the the effect is so big and then uh like i said for the costume you can get one when you open one of the following costume or oh, and one costume mileage coin this one looks really cool i like that one that one no this costume eh, it's okay ah <laughs> red and purple eye 
uh, hair and I do like this one though the squirrel tail this one uh, kind of cool it's okay this one not bad oh this one's nice and a backpack not bad right and they do have now uh, another <laughs> thing to buy so basically they're selling you a hundred nyanya vines I have no idea where to use this nyanya vines I think it's used for like for buying the removing of a card from an item I think you need nyanya bin but aside from that I don't know where but if you buy this package for $12 you'll get 12 custom mileage coin and three boxes of custom enchant slot box 30 so it will give you some uh enchant stone and some mileage coins then they have higher tier 22 dollars ooh 200 25 mileage coin and five box custom and the highest is 40 dollars dude that's expensive also includes 50 custom mileage coins and 10 boxes of custom enchant and this is uh, basically the box containing enchantment stone the enchantment 30 box 30 is here warlock sorcerer soda uh, I guess they're okay exceeding costumes are also included uh, and this is the coin obtained from custom egg purchase and nyanya bin I have no idea where to use this lastly there is a new overseas care package 61 as uh, I am super broke so I'm not buying any of these but these are the new items I really hate that the new items require you to refine your item to level 13 or refine plus 14 before you can get the items uh, full potential dude it's so expensive check this one out when refined to plus 14 you get spell plus 15 and magic attack 30% dude but <sighs> Dude, plus 14, that's out of reach for regular players. Only the dedicated ones can get that one. And the ones that pay. So I... Yeah, yeah the care package is here if you care about it too much. I don't have the money, so I'm not even going to look at it. Uh, the events that are happening are still Monster Spotlight. Enrich your fine event, 20th anniversary, which is cool because uh, it's very helpful to everyone. Kachua ore boxes. Uh, buy to get to package map break drop uh, June spend event but it's almost over July 3 tomorrow is the last day for June spend uh, I'm not spending I don't have the money summer fishing event is still happening which is nice because I still haven't gotten the costume I'm still grinding those fish and hopefully get lucky to get some of the fish uh, but the fishing event I am truly enjoying it it's it's fun it's all uh luck based so it's, it's all good so this is the new update we're getting today and hopefully you guys have a great fourth of july and i wish you well bye for now